Okay, guys, now if you haven't knocked him out from the mount yet, he hasn't given you your back, you haven't gotten the rear naked choke. If it's getting towards the end of the round and he's good at bucking his hips and hanging out frame shamrock style here, hiding his head good, you're going to do the wild wolfman and blast him. But here's an armbar to go to. In my opinion, getting up top position is a little risky, so wait till the end of the round. Have your corner yell at 30 seconds, okay, and then go for a submission. You've already dominated the position. Show the judges that you can, you can try and finish it, or really finish it. You got 30 seconds and go. That's uh, that's how you should do it, in my opinion. Here's an arm bar. Instead of the, the old school arm bars don't work nowadays, so here's an arm bar you can actually do from out. What I'm going to do is I'm going to frame his head to the opposite side, okay, and trap here and hook with my leg. So I'm going to pull back my elbow to slide and trap his arm in my armpit and lift this leg. I'm going to trap with my arm sliding back and lift my leg up. Frame the neck away, hit it, and then take the arm bar and the armpit. Okay? It's a very dangerous, I, all I got to do is tap him there, pinch down on it. It's a very dangerous submission if you fall all the way back. Where it's too fast, you got to do a stomach crunch in training so you don't snap the guy's arm. But this is a very good technique to use in MMA instead of that old style push off jujitsu arm bar that doesn't really work anymore. Okay, there again. This is like a trap arm bar from now. Here, you're going to go the opposite side that he's looking. So this time, I'm going to attack this arm because he's looking that way. Slide this back, get my trap, arm and leg. Frame, hit it, and hit arm bar. They're right there. If occasionally I'll miss this and the guy sits up right away, you've got to be ready to flow in either to uh, a swim move arm bar or transition right away to your normal plata. All right, so just know that if the guy's really strong and has fast reaction speed, sometimes he'll sit up so fast you miss hooking the head. Be ready to flow. I usually go with the Uma Plata, but if you're really good at a swim move, transition them all the way again, facing up to arm bar to spider web, you can do that as well. So just know that occasionally the guy's going to pop out. But usually you're going to surprise the guy this way because it's a physical trap in your body and you're not grabbing his arm. It's just trapped there in the arm and he's already hanging around anyway, so he's giving it to you. Right, there you go. Try that MMA in the last 30 seconds of the round and get the tap out.